Boom. What's up, guys? It's Moochie Man 91 and Game Crusaders bringing you another opening. This one is going to be Altered Genesis. Yeah, absolutely right. So it's going to be Altered Genesis. This is going to be in the sun and moon. A uh, couple chase cards in here. So you got the statue that's looking around. I think 180, 200. I got to check. Uh, my preference, though, if I'm not hitting one of the big cards, I definitely want to get red and green on a card together. Um, so I recently pulled red from a box, which y'all might have seen. I also recently pulled blue from a box. Uh, but this, uh, in Japan, they have a tag team card that's red and green. Um, but yeah, so we got a couple things we're doing with that. After this one, we do have matchless fighters coming up. But uh, let's see what we can pull from the sun and moon get side. The of. trash can. Yeah, get that trash can for you, my dude. Let's get Craddy lacking. Shout out to Chris Steele out there. For your future support. Yeah, that's true. Chris Steele always hooking it up with the support on there. And that is perfect. Ooh, nice trainer. Even though it's a basic card, I feel like that should have been a hollow. Tag Team Trainer Basic. Let's go. I felt like that should have been a hollow on there. And we got our first hollow hit. Let's see what we're working with. Hell yeah. So I'm actually pulling up the site now just so I can get a little idea of what's in the set. I kind of ordered it just for the tag team green and red or red and green rather. Red and blue, whichever you prefer to call it. But if I don't pull it, uh, our buddy Chris, his brother Chris Steele, actually pulled one or two of them. So I'm going to take his. So we got a hollow trainer. Let's go. Some type of Pokeball. Yeah, definitely chasing trainer cards today. There's a couple good trainers too, actually more expensive than uh, Red and Blue. I just wanted for, uh, you know, complete my set. Got the Team Rocket, got Blue, I got Red. I just need the Tag Team Squad. See if we can pull some fire, get some full arts going. Artwork good, look different, or? Uh, it's the first pack I've seen that actually says Pokemon on it. Pokemon, and it's on the back as well. Mm -hmm. PokemonCard.com. Weird. Everything else is in pretty much Japan. Yeah. What do you mean? Like it's not supposed to say Pokemon.com? Like every single pack that I've seen, it's all been Jap uh, Japanese. Oh, I got you. It could just be different. I can uh, take a look at the pack though, but it's the same guy we've been getting all the other ones from, so it's a uh, trusted seller and everything. And they were sealed. Was it sealed? Did you crack it? Yeah, it was yeah, sealed. I cracked it. But it was weird. The reason it was weird, it had a sticker over the actual name of the thing. Well, yeah, they uh, and they do have, sometimes they'll come with stickers like this. Yeah, um, but the name was covered up with a big, bigger sticker. Yeah, I was going to say some come with two stickers also, like uh, my last one. Let's go... If anything, to find out if they're real, um, which of course they are, so don't worry about that out there. But uh, to find out if they're real, you actually rip a card and you can tell. Um, I, I know how to tell if they're fake or not. Well, we'll rip a... No, we're we'll not rip ripping a, a full card. Yeah. Yeah. I won't even rip a hollow, unless I have to. The basics will tell me what I need to know. That's a nice hollow, actually. I think some of their packs just show different and stuff like that. Man, there's a bunch of cards. That that uh red and green card is actually like the the tenth best in the set. So there's so many cards above it. So yeah, have a good chance of pulling some uh, some heaters on this one. Got Serona, uh, Catala, uh, Catlia rather, Mao and Water Lily. But I would like the two hundred dollar statue card. 
Oh, it's insane. Yeah. This is I think. Wanted to. Yo, look at. My I'll actually take that one too, even though it's a basic card. I can put it with a. Uh, I'm really liking these tag team basic cards, man. I could probably play it on here too. Yeah, I'll do it on there so you don't have to. Let's get a full art. Haven't got a full art yet. Yeah. Oh, let's go. First full art of the night. A little GX action. Number 40 of four. Four of 40 or? Oh, 44.95. Okay. When you said 40 of four, I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> nice. Let's go sleep this bad boy up. That's a uh, flygon, but um, I'm trying to see. Wow, that trainer card, uh, the ball. There's actually a lot of trainer cards in here that are worth six or seven bucks. They are more expensive than this flygon, but not bad for a full art. Man, look at these basic cards. Ooh, nice. Little tag team, full art action. Number 65. Looks like the maybe one of the guys on the card. So, nice. so there's yeah, so there's 95 cards in cards in the set. So we still haven't pulled that secret rare yet, the ultra rare either one that comes out. Doing pretty good though. Sleep this bad boy up. Yeah, it's a $15 card all day. Let's go back to back magic. And with the hollow. Back to back to back to back. We had in between here. So that's not back to back. Don't fuck with me. Music playing in the background. I just want a red and green. Yeah, whatever, dude. Let's go get some full arts. Just got off work. A little slow tonight. But we got two boxes to open up. I'm about to get hyped up. Let's go. See if I can bring a little bit more energy. Man, we are getting some mad hollows out of this box. Let's go, get some more action. Oh, that secret rare is hiding. When we gonna get this? Oh man, the one I want. My chase card is red and green, but if I can get that $200 statue card, I'll be super happy. Let's go with the hollows. We're going to have to count how many hollows we got out of this set. His brother pulled this set, I think, only once, though, and he got some pretty decent cards. But I think we're topping him already. Yeah, red and green is about a $25 card. The one uh, I want... If we get it, it would be Arceus, uh, Diagla, uh, Dalga, and Palkia GX. It's all three in one tag team. So it's like a triple squad and it's like an alternate art statue. Let's see what we're about to pull. Let's see what kind of fire is coming up. Let's go. Some more hollow actions. I'll tell you what, these borders really mess me up. I always think it's a full art coming when I barely see it. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. What are we looking at? What's left? Not too many left. 
We got two full arts. This is Sun and Moon, so I'm expecting four full arts like usual. It'd be nice to get more, but on the next pack we're opening, we should get seven or eight out of Sword and Shield. Let's go with some tag team magic. What's your secret rare? 102 out of 95? 101. 101, nice. Let's pull this up. Nice, not too bad at all. So this is our secret rare. This is going to be our Glenn and ooh, King. We'll just call him King. Definitely a dud on this one, uh, but that's okay. How much is it? Uh, this card goes for like 15 bucks. Oh, back to bag. Got back to back. Bucks. Magic. Tag team. Yo, that's actually a nice card. I think it comes with Jigglypuff and Rainbow also. Yeah, it does. So there's a Rainbow version of this. Yeah, so nice. So we're still uh, we're still hitting pretty good though because uh, our secret rare we didn't really hit too good on there. How much did you say one? About fifteen. Let's see if we can get more than four full arts though. But so I'm gonna have to give your brother twenty bucks for that. Uh, I'm gonna buy that twenty five dollar card from. I told him I give him twenty for it. The offer, rather. See, that jiggly puff's nice. This has that same plated art too, that uh, uh, stained glass. Got the artwork that it looks like stained glass in the back. We hopped up to four fucking four. It's super quick, eh? Well, at the very end, um, I think we only have two packs left. Two or three. Yeah, three, four. So yeah, kind of towards the end, about twenty-five cards in, we actually hit all four of them. Twenty-five packs. Took us a while to get one. Let's go with some hollows, man. I don't think I've seen a duplicate hollow. Yeah, what's crazy about this set is, um, you know, I was thinking that, oh, I'm gonna hit a loss on this one, but uh, we got about forty dollars in full arts right there, and forty, forty-five. But with these hollows in Japan, what's good about it is a lot of them go. Oh my god, for anywhere from three to eight dollars a piece, depending on what cards you have. Like a lot of these cards we have are five, six bucks on the site. Well, let me get a hollow red and green at least, just a hollow. Give me a regular. I think that's the most hollows we've ever got in one pack. Last pack magic, guys. Last pack magic. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So maybe we've gotten more hollows before. Let's go. Nine tails. Yeah, that's your boy Nine Tails. That will go good with the full art we pulled the other day, the Alolan uh, Nine Tails. Yeah, that's bad. So we definitely hit balance, guys. Sorry, guys. We definitely hit on a um, few good cards out here, though, just to go over some of the stuff that we got. See if I can hype up the next showing too. Did some pretty decent pulls on hollows. And I treat these pretty good because I'm a big hollow fan now that I'm collecting Japanese cards. Wasn't too big on the hollows in America, but uh Japanese cards, we gotta get it. Some of the full arts. We didn't hit the one I wanted for the secret rare. We kind of lost out on that. Uh, but this card, like I said, was actually worth a good amount. Uh, the other two cards are normal. You know, you're going to find them five, six bucks. And then we got the secret rare anywhere from 12 to $15. Ooh, almost dropped it. Not bad, though. But, uh, yeah, uh, that's it for that. So if you uh, find us on YouTube, go ahead and hit like or subscribe. Uh, I'm going to hype up the other video next. And um, also on Facebook, follow us. Uh, we are going to be doing openings every couple days. We just got done doing Silver Lance and Black Jets Poltergeist, I believe it is. I actually got two more of each boxes coming. I think Tuesday and Friday next week coming from Japan. So we got four boxes to open. This is going to be my first Matchless Fighters. I haven't opened this set yet. His brother did. And I was there for it. So I, I know what's in it. I know what we're chasing. And I'm excited. So we'll be putting this video up and then that one next. Y'all have a good one.